What's up, guys? Wes here, reviewing, quickly reviewing the Mars Yard Overshoe. I'm a big fan of this shoe for two reasons. First of all, you got the artist's process. You got everything he thinks of, how he does his things. And then you got a story inside of a story because there is a $4,000 shoe inside of this shoe, which is kind of crazy. So like, I don't know if you can see, but there's the original Mars Yards in there. And those, those shoes are an extremely coveted shoe. Like a lot of, everyone wants, everyone wants a Mars Yard. So basically what this, what Tom Sash decided to do was take a shoe, which everyone wants and cover it up with what people seem to not want, which is what well, looks like a garbage bag, in my opinion, kind of. It's cool though, and it's never been done. So, as an artist, I find that like really interesting how you take you take something that's beloved and that everyone wants, and you you force them to like it with something they don't like on top of it. So just the layer the layering of this project is really what interests me. And then on top of that, you got the whole unboxing experience. So you have these these papers. You have the box, super interesting. It's a big box. You got extra insoles, a little, little bit more information. It says uh, plutonium, our solar system. They're all about they're all about space and traveling and kind of kind of like an astronaut boot, right? Kind of looks like that. And then you got these buckles. The white and blue reminds us of the classic astronaut suit. And then obviously inside you got the classic shoe. So it's an homage to both worlds, in my opinion. At the same time critiquing critiquing materialism and consumerism and and uh, our society at the same time. And that's what really that's what really is, is cool about these shoes is that it's not just another designer, like Tom Sash really had a had a vision. And he it doesn't matter what what other people thought, he he brought it to life. And for an artist that's what's most important. Some people some people are even cutting the bags off. So you take you take the whole bag off, and then all you have left are, if some people take the buckles off too, but you take this off here, you go along here, and then you have, I don't have a Mars Yard here, but, oh, I really need a pair of these now. <laughs> Size 11, hit me up. Size 11, 11 and a half. You know who to go to. Central.west. It's going to be in the, in the thing. So, yeah. So you cut this off here, and then you get, you get the OG Tom Sash. As you can see there. OG Tom Sash, but with a nice blue sole. Oh, oh, you're doing a video. Yeah. Okay. How you doing, Luja? I'm trying to get a shoe, but I'm not tall enough. <laughs> All right. So yeah, you got some nice, some nice branding, nice solid materials. Yeah, you got Tom Sash in there, overshoe. And then on top of the extra insoles, you get an extra pair of OG insoles, which are pretty sick, you know, a little bit of support. You got the tightener, you pull this when they're on and it tightens the shoe. Honestly, like, this shoe is a full, full-time project. It's a full, like, if you want to spend money on a, a resale shoe, this is the shoe to get. You get so much, you get so much bang for your buck. And I'm dead serious, like, Look at this. Look how much material is on here. The cost of these shoes is probably so much so much more than other shoes. Like it's he it's heavy. Okay. All right. What else? What so else is there? Details. Details. Yeah. No, yeah, so many details. That's the thing. It's like I don't know how long this project took him. But so many details. I really like just reviewing them makes me want want more. Want want more want them more how do you i feel like now that i now that i like un unbuckled it it's like not folded the right way yeah, yeah. clip clip oh my god that's so suave <laughs> the same um, follow central MTL. yeah MTL. so you know how it goes follow central mtl no you know how it goes 
Follow central.mtl on Instagram. Online opening soon. And you know, come through. We have the heat. Always, always. We always have the heat. And if you're looking for the heat, come see us and tell us. And we'll get you the heat. That's how it works. Man, these are crazy. And 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 they're water water resistant. It's like a rain boot. Do you know how sick that is? It's a hype a hype rain boot. Bro, a hype rain boot. You don't you don't even understand. They're so hype, another guy came with another pair, size eleven. No. Blown. When, when, when? Right now. <laughs> oh shit! Oh uh, damn, he tried to kill me. <laughs> <laughs> I should have worn this. What size?